Former Nevada Senate Majority Leader Kelvin At At Atkinson, excuse me, is set to be sentenced tomorrow on federal wire fraud charges. Politics Now co-host Patrick Walker has been closely following this story for months now. He joins us live in the newsroom, and Patrick Atkinson has admitted to and apologized for using nearly a quarter million dollars in campaign contributions for personal use. What kind of sentence is he looking at? Well, Brian, he is looking at prison time as part of a plea deal. Back in early March, news of Atkinson's then imminent resignation. Well, it really didn't surprise many Carson City insiders, but his tearful speech still reverberated around the Senate chamber. It is with great sadness I am announcing my resignation from the state Senate and, the, and this legislative body. Atkinson announced his resignation after the feds had closed in on him. The U.S. Attorney's Office says investigators discovered more than $450,000 in purchases that were not accounted for in Atkinson's campaign finance documents over an eight-year period. Atkinson admitted to bilking $249,900 of campaign cash and using it to help open his bar downtown, that's the Urban Lounge, also to lease a luxury SUV and to pay off hundred grand in credit card debt, among other things. Investigators also found out he co-mingled his private and campaign bank accounts, something that is expressly forbidden under state law. Regretfully, it has been discovered that I have used campaign funds for personal use. Thus, I will be taking full responsibility for that. Well, Atkinson learned of the investigation in late January when federal agents served a search warrant. The U.S. Attorney's Office is asking for 30 months, and Atkinson's attorneys are asking for a lower sentence. He is scheduled to be sentenced by a federal judge tomorrow morning at 1030. I'll be there, and we'll have the latest online and on air as the day unfolds. Live in the newsroom, I'm Patrick Walker, 8 News Now.